People in Aransas County are fired up after the city of Aransas Pass announced plans to annex certain areas of the county. And tonight in a town hall meeting, neighbors talked about their concerns. Taylor Alanis joins us with what they and the city had to say. It is our top story tonight. Taylor. Rudy and Mackenzie, neighbors I talked with tonight say they never wanted to be part of the city and they can't understand why Aransas Pass leaders are forcing them to. Aransas Pass City Manager Gary Edwards says the city of Corpus Christi's interest in a part of Aransas Pass ETJ got the ball rolling on their current annexation plan. So the ETJ is basically what you would call the city's breathing room. It is a section of land that is technically not city limits, but a city could eventually annex it for future growth. Edwards says Aransas Pass leaders annexing is their way of trying to protect what is around their area, but county residents aren't buying it. The people I spoke to say they are not in Corpus Christi's ETJ, so why does the city of Aransas Pass feel the need to save them? The tax increase, uh, the concerns that they're not going to provide city utilities to them like they're supposed to in their service plan, which is a legitimate concern considering we do have areas within the city that still have not received city services. Edwards says annexation is always a battle and he understands neighbors' concerns, but says the city has already been discussing those ideas. A service plan for areas that we uh, anticipate, all this is proposed, none of this has really happened yet, that we anticipate uh, annexing and how we uh, can provide those services and what's, what are going to be the funding sources for those services. Esquivel says neighbors are also concerned about code enforcement. She says the area the city is looking at is very low income and after suffering the devastation of Hurricane Harvey, a lot of people still have some cleaning up to do. They are worried once annexed, the city will find them. She says if they can't afford to fix it, they can't afford paying a ticket. Right now there are two phases of the annexation plan, but Edwards says phase two is not set in stone. Edwards says there will be public hearings April 30th and May 1st for one of the areas they are trying to annex. Rudy McKenzie. All right, thank you, Taylor, for that update.